It is late and I got my boy with us. Ice, ice, ice baby. He's so handsome. <laughs> Five weeks out. What a week it has been. So lots to update y'all on. Sorry, Ice, I had to turn the light on. <laughs> so Monday, I went and got my blood work redone. And then Wednesday, I went and met with my doctor. Hormones are doing pretty good. So testosterone is good, but my thyroid medicine did go up. So they gave me a little bit higher dosage just because they want to see my thyroid levels come up a little bit more. I did my check-in on Wednesday. My measurements were the same. I did hit a new low, so I was 146.6, and thinking that's pretty good for how far I've come at the start of this prep. My first stage weight was at 141, so I'm still five pounds from that, and not that I'm expecting to get to my last stage weight because I'm pretty sure I've put on some muscle. Would I like to get close to that? Absolutely. I have under five weeks now, so we'll see what happens. But some things that my coach said during my check-in was I did look tighter and drier. She gave me some tips on what I needed to fix with my posing because I sent her a posing video. And she gave me three high days. Just wanted to give y'all that update. I'm ready to go to the beach. I'm all packed up. I'm leaving tomorrow. Let's go. Just got done with work. Today is my birthday. So I'm about to go home and get ready for this drive. I'm in a rush trying to get out of here, but my dad brought me a gift. He brought me some flowers and a balloon. <laughs> and I thought this was so funny, but it's so cute. Look how beautiful. And then look at what the balloon says. <laughs> he didn't do that on purpose. He said that all the balloons around it said happy birthday and he just picked up the prettiest flowers he saw and it just happened to be the anniversary balloon that he picked. But it was super funny and I just thought that was so cute. I'm about to go shower now and get my stuff together and head to the beach. I'm so excited. <laughs> Finally, it was horrific trying to get in here. My hydro jug shattered and the food fell all over the floor, but we made it. <laughs> but I did bring my food with me for the next couple days. It should last me. I got broccoli, spinach, cashews. Shout out to my mom for helping me out. I got some coffee creamer, sugar-free, cold brew coffee, sweet potatoes, and then I have some chicken down there for protein. I don't think I'm gonna work out today just from traveling, so I'm gonna take a little off day. I'm gonna be behind on my strength training, so I'm probably gonna hit back and legs tomorrow. I'm just gonna have a good time tonight. It's my birthday.
finished back and legs today. It's hot, ready to go to the beach. Just got done with strength training. I am hitting the beach to do some cardio. I'm going to jog for 30 minutes and then hit some sprints on the beach. Let's get it done. got off the beach and was almost impaled by an umbrella on some final destination shit. It's very windy out on the beach and someone's rental umbrella came out of the ground and was charging straight at me. Luckily I saw it as it was coming towards me and only I'm left with this little ankle injury where the pole hit me. Get Ooh, that hurt. I'm getting some swelling right here you can see it's not coming up Ooh, that was so scary but shit happens you know <laughs> my boyfriend's going to get some stuff to clean it and band-aids and everything i will be fine you know thank god i'm okay i'm gonna try and take a shower patch this up see how i'm feeling i still want to go have dinner tonight and just deal with it however we can Umbrellas flying everywhere. in general and working and yeah that's it for this vlog see ya <laughs>